Look at this big, gorgeous burdock. This is a first year burdock. You can see the wider, wide, wide leaves with a little bit of a rib in the side. So burdock leaves can be wrapped around food, but that's not like really the edible part. The, the stalk I think is partially edible, but really what you want is the root. And you want to get the root either the end of the, the uh, first year, you know, beginning, second year possibly. This is a good, this is perfect. If it looks like this in the ground, you want to dig the root on that. And burdock root is a blood alternative, a blood cleanser. Um, it also is a food source, so you can eat burdock root as food. Look, ooh, ooh, there's chickweed in here too. There's chickweed. So there's two medicinal plants right there next to each other. That is fleabane. And this is yellow dock. Yellow, you see yellow dock? It's the same kind of dock family plant. But you see how that's long and skinny versus burdocks, big giant leaves. These come up, up with these giant burrs and stuff too. So the, the seeds I think are, are also medicinal. But yeah, check out burdock. Burdock is fantastic medicine. So is yellow dock. So is fleabane. And so especially is chickweed. I'm going to eat this right now. See, I just broke the root. These have ridiculously deep tap roots, okay? I'm talking like they go three, four feet in the ground or more. But that root is the medicinal part and the edible part, and I am totally going to work with this. There's some yellow dock. This is a yellow dock. I don't have a lot growing in my garden at the moment because I keep harvesting it because I like it so much. But the, the long, it's also known as curly dock. So this is um, Rumex Crispus, uh, yellow dock. Is, it's, uh, the leaves don't look yellow, okay? so. Now, if I dig this up, the root is very, very yellow. This is how you identify it. It's got a curly, long, skinny leaf. You can eat the young leaves when they first come up. This one got kind of beat up, so I'm gonna wait until it has any more leaves before I eat them. Um, you don't wanna eat a ton of them, but you can definitely eat. Uh, they're, they're, not, they're not bad, especially if you blanch them or something first. Um, the root is really the um, powerhouse of medicine here, and that is what can help uh, nutrient absorption. So this helps your body absorb iron. Now the yellow dock root contains iron. So this is some yellow dock root. Um, you can see the plant, what the plant looks like here. I just dug this up. Um, it's also known as curly dock, Rumex crispus. Um, the leaves are edible. Uh, you really should like boil them. I guess they're, they're pretty high in oxalic acid, but they're all right. Nah, I'm raw. Long, long tap root. This is how it grows in the ground. Long tap root. So uh, Rumex crispus, yellow dock. It's called yellow dock because of the root. I mean, look at that. Look how yellow that is. That is a yellow, yellow root. Okay. So this is, um, again, this is a bitter. This is a blood alternative. This, uh, helps move other herbs along in your system pretty quickly because it cleanses the liver so fast. Um, it's got a high iron content, but you'll, you would have to, um, like decoct it to get that. And that's really gross because this is very bitter. Um, you can blend this with some other herbs like burdock root or um, ginger or I don't know, something that tastes good because this does not taste good. Um, you can also, there's some study doing um, a tincture of this uh, mixed with molasses to uh, increase your iron content. Anyway, it's a free weed. And, and in the fall, when these things shoot up their flower stalks and you can collect the seeds, the seeds are actually really yummy. I made flour with them last year and put them in like um, banana bread and it was really good. It was uh, like tasty and earthy and extra vitamins and minerals. So I'm probably going to eat these. Yay! By the way, this uh, other dock looking thing is dock. This is Rumex obtusifolius. Rumex obtusifolius, aka bitter dock, because Yes, it's medicinal, just like the, the roots of burdock and yellow dock are medicinal, but this is like the most bitter, disgusting thing you will ever taste in your life. So, of course, it's the most invasive and absolutely everywhere, and it's hell to get rid of. So, anyway, that's bitter dock. Don't mistake it. Bitter dock uh, has the medium-sized leaves with like the red rib in the middle. Again, yellow dock and the burdock from the other um, section of the video.